hi guys welcome back to my channel i am miss ebony lux and if you're new here go ahead and hit that subscribe button all right y'all so today i decided to do a low sleek ponytail using shake and go straight and wavy hair and my product of choice today is got to be glue spray and the black beeswax so i've sprayed the heat protectant on and I'm just suctioning her off and I'm gonna go ahead and get her blow dried out and pressed out as well. I'm using my Keras Silk Heat Protectant by Goldwell, and I'm just gonna spray this all over. Um, this also adds shine to the hair right before flat ironing. All right, so she asked for a zigzag middle part. So I'm just parting her out now. All right, and I'm just gonna check and make sure she likes it. And then I'm gonna section her front off. So we're gonna have three sections here. 
just for, to make it easier for me to slick her ponytail down. Here I am with the black beeswax. So I'm gonna put her hair into a ponytail first, just to make sure that I have the ponytail in the right spot, like directly in the middle of her head. And then also making sure that she's comfortable with where it's at as well before securing it into place, okay? And so using my comb, I'm just going to go ahead and spread it all over her ponytail while also combing it into place and pulling all those hairs in and slicking them down. And you want to make sure that you always comb that wax all the way through because if not, it will turn white on you. And it will look a mess and we don't want them problems so we can make sure that we comb it all the way through and sleek it out you gotta sleek it out All right, so I'm going to remove the ponytail and use my comb to comb those other hairs into place, all the hairs that bunched up around it. And then I'm going to use my black rubber band to secure the ponytail into place before using my got to be glue. All right, so now we have that. I'm going to spray the got to be glue on there all over. And then I'm going to use my blow dryer on high heat, on hot heat to go ahead and secure it into place. All right, so I'm gonna do the same thing here on this side, making sure that I am pulling that beeswax all the way through her hair and securing it into place. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and braid her natural hair and secure it with a rubber band at the end. So 
So I'm going to go ahead and add my black wrapping paper. I've already added glue to that tip so that it stays in place. I'm just going to wrap that as tight as I can around her head. Then I'm going to add a second strip and wrap that one around as well while also tucking in her ends towards the bottom. So I'm just going to actually tuck that right on under and then wrap around again. That way none of her hair is out or showing. So I'm just going to use a little bit more glue and then I'm going to dry that in place. All right, so here's the Shake and Go Straight Wavy Hair that I purchased from the beauty supply stores. I'm going to use one and maybe like a quarter, if a quarter of hair. And I'm just going to go ahead and wrap it. Now, I am double wefting the first bundle all the way around versus single wrapping it. All right, here I am with the second bundle that I'm going to single wrap around her base here. So I'm just going to blow, that, blow dry that in place and just keep adding small amounts of glue. Like I said, I didn't use a lot of hair off of this bundle. Just a little bit to help me secure her base here. All right, so I'm going to begin wrapping her ponytail. So I'm just going to wrap that piece at the end and using my got to be and just spraying about every wrap or every other wrap, just making sure that's secured in place and also using my blow dryer in the process as well. All right, so here we are. So I went ahead and did her edges off camera, but here are the final results. Let me guys know what you think. I think it's beautiful as always. I think it came out perfect. Um, if you guys have questions, feel free to hit me up. Uh, message me in the comments, DM me on Instagram. That is my Instagram handle below at Miss Ebony Lux. And thank you guys so much for watching and tuning in with me today. I really appreciate it. Bye.